But depending where you are, we're waking up to a mixed bag. Dry, warmer conditions today across Metro Denver. Temperatures yesterday were nice and cool. Today we're back to near 90 degrees and we'll stay in the upper 80s to low 90s both Saturday and Sunday. A big cool down is on the way. It'll start feeling a lot more like fall here across the state come Monday and Tuesday with even a little mountain snow expected. I'll show you that coming up. But right now temperatures are climbing to the high 50s into Highlands Ranch down into Castle Rock. Boulder started off in the low 40s now at 50 degrees. Same up into Netherlands upper 30s into a lot of our mountain towns and you can see from our satellite and radar no alerts in effect but in Grand Junction starting to pick up a little indicated radar rain and up and down the I-25 corridor in eastern plains it will be a dry afternoon. Storm outlook for today no risk of severe weather but we are looking at the chance for isolated thunderstorm activity west of the divide Eagle Aspen into Vail later on this afternoon so keep that in mind if you are hiking or spending time into the mountains today it's going to be dry for the first half of the morning but you can see right around 1230 winds kick up clouds increase up near Leadville and Aspen, up through Steamboat Springs, about a 20% possibility of a few of those isolated thunderstorms. Gusty winds, pockets of moderate rainfall will be the main threats. We'll be at 90 degrees by that point under a partly to mostly cloudy sky. A little more cloud coverage Denver north through Fort Collins and Greeley this evening. Clear skies from the springs and out east and tonight into early tomorrow. Could be seeing some of those lingering showers and isolated storms over higher terrain before we gradually clear out for tomorrow. Highs today will be in the upper 80s in Boulder, low 80s in Evergreen, 90s, Highlands Ranch, downtown Denver, up through New Raymer, Sterling and Fort Morgan, down south Pueblo, Lamar, La Hunta, all in the 90s as well, and up into the high country from Steamboat down through Aspen, another warmer than average afternoon, 80s there at the valley level. So pretty hot and dry for today and tomorrow. There are those isolated storms through this evening and in through tomorrow, another round of seeing a few storms possible, but Monday the big changes arrive. This cold front will move in from the north northwest. You can see that blue Snow is possible over higher terrain into the high country and then much cooler weather will settle in to start the week before some sunshine and hotter days return. So here's what it looks like on the seven day. We get that last little taste of summer. The official end of summer is actually on the 22nd. That'll be Wednesday and we'll be back to the 80s by that point. But you can see Monday and Tuesday showers possible. Temperatures only in the high 60s to right around 70 degrees. Definitely some sweater weather in store, especially on Tuesday morning with a low of 42 degrees. Back to the low to mid 80s Wednesday and Thursday and seasonal weather returns Eric for next weekend.